Hey guys, we're gonna go on an O hunt. We're gonna try to find some words that have the letter O. Now remember, there's something special about a letter O. It's called a vowel. It's because it has two sounds. It can go O or ah, O or ah. So it's very special because it can have those two sounds. So we're gonna try to find some words that have the ah in it or the o oh in it, okay? So I'm gonna go around and do a little hunt in my teacher room, our mini classroom, and see if we can find something with o oh for ah. So let's flip the camera and don't forget to go get your board, your markers, your boogie board, um, your paper and pencil, so that way you can write with it, okay? So hit pause, go get your things, and come back if you need to, and then hit play. So we're gonna go ahead and flip the camera. So I'm gonna look around my room and I'm gonna see if I can find anything. <gasps> I found an orange marker! Okay, so, but before I do my orange marker, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and write my O on my board like we did with our other letters, okay? So I'm gonna start at the top and I'm just gonna make a circle. Start at the top, make a circle. Start at the top, make a circle. Good job, guys. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and do the lowercase O. So I'm gonna start in the middle, but I'm still starting at the top, okay? So little circle, pretty easy, huh? We're gonna do another one, a little circle, and then we're gonna do another little circle. So I want you to write your O's all the way across your paper or your board or boogie board, okay? So go ahead and write your O's. Now I'm gonna write my one, so I have a one, come straight down and that is all, my two. Curve around and go to the right, and then I'm gonna do my three, halfway around and around again. And now I know that I'm gonna be writing three words that have an O. Well, since I found an orange marker, look, I have even another orange marker. So I'm gonna do the word orange. Now remember, if you can't do the word orange, that's okay. Just go ahead and put your O. So you can go ahead and do an O. Or, or, or oh, I hear another letter. I hear R. I'm gonna line down, rainbow to the side. Orange. Oh, I hear an N, so line down. Rainbow to the side, orange, j. It does sound like a J sound, so if you did put a J, that's okay because that's what it sounds like. But orange is actually a G. It's a soft G, and we'll learn about that later. Okay, so if you wrote those letters because you heard them for orange, that's good. But if you only wrote that O, that is okay too. Only write the O if that's all you can do right now. That is fine. We'll do more with the sounds later. Okay, so now Miss Keegan's gonna draw an orange marker and I'm gonna make it look like this marker. Hmm. So I'm gonna make it look like that and it's just a cylinder. Hmm. Let's see, let's see. All right, so I'm gonna draw a circle and a line and a line. And then I'm gonna close it and then it has some lines on it and then it's got some lines over here. So, you know, and then I'm gonna put an orange there so that way, oh look, Miss Keegan has an orange marker. And then I'm gonna put some squiggly marks because you know, we wrote with it, silly me, right? So we have orange. All right, now I'm gonna go find another O word. Let's see, let's see if I can find anything else that has an O. <gasps> Look, I found an oval. So we're gonna go ahead and put oval on our board. Now remember, if all you can do is just that O, just put that O right now, that's okay, just put an O. So oval, okay, I hear a V, so for my friends that know the, hear the other sounds, go ahead and put that. Oval, oval, oh, I hear an L, so I'm gonna put an L, a line down, so now we have oval. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw an oval, and I'm gonna draw one sideways, I'm gonna draw one diagonal, Draw one up and down, and oval is just a long circle. So try to write the word oval and draw some ovals for me. All right, we need one more thing that has an O. I wonder, let's see. Is there anything else with an O? Hmm, I don't, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Things are everywhere. I found an octagon. Now stop signs are shaped like an octagon. So we're gonna go ahead and write octagon on our board. Now remember, if all you can write is an O, that's okay. 
And the cool thing is about an octagon, guys, is that it has eight sides. That's how you know oct. Oct means eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But we're gonna go ahead and write the word though, okay? So if you can only do your O, just write your O. That is okay. Now, when I'm saying octagon, octagon, what else do I hear? Oc, k, k. Ooh, I hear a C, so I'm gonna put a C. Oct, oct. Oh, I'm gonna put a T, line down and cross. Octa, uh, uh. Ooh, that's an A, circle and a stick. Octa, g, g, g. Ooh, I hear another, I hear a G. There's a G. Oct, oh, oh, there's another O in it. Octagon has two O's, how cool is that? Octagon, ooh, I hear an N, so lying down, rainbow to the side. So I wrote the word octagon. Now, if you can't hear all those sounds, like I said, it's okay. Just write the O, that's all we need right now. That's all we need, it's just that O. All right, so octagon. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna try to draw an octagon. So I'm gonna do a line down at the bottom and a line on the bottom, so there's two lines. And then a line on the side, a line on the side. There's two. All right, now we're gonna draw, we're gonna connect everything, and those are more lines. So we kind of have an octagon. Miss Keegan kind of can do it. Let's try it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, I can almost draw one. I'm not very good at it, but at least I'm trying, right? And that's all that matters. It's part of our mindsets. So we don't give up and we try again, don't we? So now I have the color orange, an oval, and an octagon, okay? What I want you to do is I want you to go in your house, go find some things that have the letter O. It can be at the beginning, it could be in the middle, somewhere where you hear O or ah. So I want you to go find things that are like that, okay? Like da ah og. You might have a dog at home and it has the O in the middle. So try to find things with an O, okay? Get me three of them. And remember, you can take a video of you finding those three things. You can write it on your board for me and take a picture and send it to me. But make sure you put it up on Canvas so I can see what O words you were able to find. I hope you guys have some fun and I can't wait to see what you come up with. Bye.